So Tom Reed here happened to met, meet this gentleman and uh, walked up to him. I asked him. Uh, he said he's homeless. And your name, sir? Jacob Ryan. Okay, Jacob. And uh, I take these videos and I upload them to YouTube. You okay with that? Yes, sir. Oh. And I, also, I was trying to get to Rockford because I have a family member that I might be able, might be able to stay with. Okay, well, I'll see if I can hook you up with that, okay? Yes, so, uh, how did you end up around this area? I started out down there in Waycross, in, down there by, by the Florida line, uh -huh. and I had, met a friend, I had met a friend online, and I was one, and I came up here to see how the situation would go, and I wound up out here. Okay, and uh, what type normal or traditional jobs have you had in your life? I've done fast food restaurants. Okay. I've done assembly line. Okay. I have done plants. That's about it. Okay. And when's the last time you were employed? 2019, okay. May the 29th. Okay. And you mentioned that you just got out of prison. Yes, I got out of prison on on May the 31st of 19. I had a job not too long after and I'll end up losing my job. Okay, where where you where were you in prison? I've been to Valdosta, I've been to Hayes, Waycross, Terre Faire, Central, okay. Breezeville. And what uh, were you in prison for? I was in prison for an aggravated battery. Okay, and what happened there? I got hit and I and I hit the person back. Okay. Uh, I'm assuming they tried to take my money. They tried to take everything from me. Oh, okay. And I defended myself basically. Okay. And you ended up in all those places from that one incident? Yes, because they gave me five years. Okay. Had, had you had a prior record before then? No. Wow. And how's your family life? Did you come from a pretty decent family or? So so. Not real good, but basic basics. Okay. Yeah. Are you a high school graduate? No, sir. Okay. What uh, grade did you drop out in? 11th grade. Okay. Did you uh, have any good childhood memories you can think of? Besides spending time with my mom, that was about it. Okay. I, I very rarely ever got to do that. All right. You got a favorite book? No, sir. A favorite movie? I don't watch TV. Not at all, huh? Yeah, no, you're sir. smart for doing that. I cut mine off about a year ago. Now, do you, how do you keep up with current events, or do you just you just hear it through the grapevine, or it doesn't interest you that much? I use my phone. You use your phone. Okay. And what do you think of the current like climate of the United States? How do you feel about it? It's okay. It's a basic place to live. It's decent, but certain spots could be worse than others. Okay. You're a religious guy at all? No, sir. Okay. And what's your plans then? Uh, your now? What are, you, what are you looking for? I'm looking to start a family with, with this this uh, young woman that I, that I've been talking to. Oh, okay, good, good. And where? How'd you meet her? I met her through school. Good. What kind of school is that? In America's High. Oh, okay. And what is that exactly? It's down there in America's Georgia. Oh, okay. So you're keeping in touch with her. Yes, sir. Okay. Any alcohol problems in your life? No, sir. Any drug problems? Cigarettes. That's it. That's a drug. But I'm right. pretty much done. Pretty much stopped here. Gotcha. Well, you got any questions for me? No, sir. Well, I appreciate you taking the time to talk to me. Yes, sir. You have a good day. You too. All right, man.